Did you get it all? I think you got it all. Here, I think you missed a spot. There you go. Thanks. Um, <laughs> it's Paisley. Right, Paisley. We should get out of here. Yeah, let's head out. My collar feels gross. There's nothing on it anymore, but it sure feels like it. You wanna put your collar in this bag until you get home? Yeah, that actually would be great. All right, now let's go catch up with the others. Wow, lunch is already over. Hey Claire, since we're in the next class together, do you want me to walk with you? I'm actually begging you, please. All right, cool, so let's go. Claire, I really need to talk to you. Haven't you done enough to her? Claire, you don't have to speak to her if you don't want to. Please, Claire, I, I really I really need to explain myself. Please, you barely talk as it is. Claire, she's just gonna waste your time. Yeah, so let's just go. Claire, please, I do really feel bad. Keep going, Claire. I'm sorry, Serenity. <laughs> I think she's gone. I think I might have the class after that session. Hey, one minute. I actually need to ask you something. About what? The bathroom situation. The bathroom situation? Yeah, you, you cleaned Claire's face. Okay. You were a little too nice to her. What? I'm just, I'm just being nice. Yeah, but based on last year, you're being a little too nice. You've asked me to be nicer to her this year, and that's what I'm doing. What's the big deal? The big deal is you being fake. Claire doesn't want another repeat of last year. That includes being fake. <sighs> I'm not being fake. Oh, really? Because suddenly you're being so nice to her and forgetting about what you did. Remember those notes that you put in her locker? Those comments about her body saying it's ugly and fat. What's your point? Why can I not just forget about what happened last year and move on? Because I'm still surprised you haven't even told her. You want to be friends with her all of a sudden, but be fake. So what, you want me to tell her what I did last year? Wouldn't that make us enemies then? But if you told her what you told me and that you're really, really sorry, she'll understand. Please, that, that's not gonna happen. So you're not gonna tell her what you did last year? And just gonna be fake towards her? I wanna be nice to her and I wanna move on. She doesn't have to know about that, just let it go. Well, how about no? How about yes? Because I don't know why you care about your sister so much, because you treat her like crap. I don't treat my sister like crap, please. I don't. <laughs> yeah, whatever, Arya. Me and you both know damn well you have a crush on her. Shut up. You know, for someone who has a crush on her, leaving negative notes about her body in her locker last year was really uncalled for. I guess I'm just not understanding why you did it. It won't make sense to you. I just want to know whatever you're hiding. I'll find out sooner than later. And I highly doubt that. Wouldn't the world want to know that you're gay? A closeted lesbian? Get away from me, Arya. We're not friends anymore. Yeah, that's not how that's gonna go. You have to stay friends with me if you expect me to keep your little secret. That you're a closeted lesbian and you have a crush on my sister, but yet put all those negative notes in her body and god all the other things you've done. What you did to Maddie, what you did to Carter. I mean, hell, who else have you not done anything to? And that's not counting the people that already know that you did that to them. You're a real bitch, Arya. See you at lunch tomorrow. Toulouse. Kinsley? 
Hey, Saran, a good job earlier, by the way. You hit the wrong target, but we'll give you bonus points for even doing it. What? Girl, the pie thing literally happened two periods ago. Are you serious? You threw a pie in Claire's face instead of Arya's. But it doesn't matter because all you needed to hit is at least one of the Monroe sisters. But why? Dog, can you speak up? I can barely hear you. I know, right? She barely talks. Like, speak. Come on. Oh my dog, Saran, let go! Don't ever mess with Claire again. Girls, that is enough. Let go of her, Caldwell. My office now. Kinsley, are you okay? Kinsley, oh my dog, yeah, are you okay? What about your heart? Oh my dog, are any scars? Oh my dog, I'm so sorry. Make this quick, Paisley, I'm ready to go home. What's your problem? Considering the circumstance that Serenity just got done throwing me up against a locker because of something that she did, you tell me. Oh my dog, really? Are you okay? No, I'm traumatized. Was that before or after she ran up to Claire begging for forgiveness? Dog, I don't know what her problem is, but she needs to get it together. I guess that takes it as she's not in our little group anymore. For now, I don't know who the hell she thinks she is backstabbing me like that. I mean, dog, it's not like I forced her to do it. She did it willingly. I don't even know why all of a sudden she even likes Claire. I thought we agreed we all hated her. What do you mean like? Like she wants to be friends with her or something. It's weird. Do you think she's, you know, Serenity? Gay? Please, I would know. I know Serenity isn't right in her head at the moment, but I know she's not that messed up. Me and you both know how much gays have been frowned upon in this society. Yeah, I, I know it's crazy. It's not that crazy. I mean, think common sense. Why would anybody want to be with the same gender? You can't even have kids. It's wrong. Yeah, totally wrong. Oof. Yeah, so anyways. I have a plan anyways to get back at her. Serenity? Yes, because nobody's gonna throw me up against a walker and tell me what to do. I'll text you the details later. But for now, I'll see you later. My mom's gonna kill me when she finds out I got detention for the first time. Detention for what? Also, why are you talking to yourself? Claire. Yeah, that that's me. Listen, Claire, I'm really, really sorry for what I did. I didn't mean to do it. I just, I was just doing what Kinsley said. Kinsley? <sighs> no surprise. Yeah, I was just doing what she said. I it's okay. You're forgiven. Wait, really? You're gonna forgive me? Yeah, don't get that excited. I still have some trust issues with you. Y yeah, it's understandable. Where'd your collar go? Oh, it's in my bag. Well, why aren't you wearing it? You look pretty in it. I mean, it's not because somebody, you know, threw a pie in my face. Right, yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm fucking with you. Can't you tell? Um, you know what, forget it, it's okay. So are you getting ready to go home? Yeah, I'm just waiting on my sister. Your sister? Yeah, Aria, she's my sister. Oh. Well, what are you waiting on her for? Oh, she was gonna go give me one of her extra collars. I feel naked. And cold. Oh. Um, what? Oh, what's wrong? Did I did I do something? You said you were cold. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm okay. I just didn't expect that. What, me, me to offer you my jacket? No, you're just... <laughs> we have fur. We have fur. Yeah, no doubt, but you just took it off like that? It's a, it's a jacket? Well, I, I can't wear it. What? Why not? Because it's yours. And and what? And well, why aren't why you aren't wearing you it? it? You look pretty in it. What? Did I do something wrong again? Sorry, here I'll put it back on. Claire, your face is turning pink. No, it's no it's not. No, it's not. Do you need some water? I have a few dollars. We can go get a water. No, 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 no. It's okay. Here, wear my jacket. You must be cold. Alright. Yeah. Fine. You know, it's weird when you watch me put on clothes. We have fur. See, you wouldn't open up to me in class, but now you will? What, what's going on in your head? What do you mean, what's going on in my head? By what you're doing? What? Why are you looking at me like that? I... nothing. Nothing. Okay then. Where are you going? I'm waiting for my sister. Why? You have clothes now. You know I have to give this back to you, right? Like, I can't just keep it. 
Why not? You can if you want. I have like a million jackets. Stop. What? You're being way too nice to me. What? What don't you understand? What? What are you talking about? What do you mean what I don't understand? By what you're doing? What am I doing? Being friendly, nice, compassionate, kind. How do we? How, how long do I have to explain this to you? You pie me in the face, and then you just and then I just what? Apologize? Be nice to you like I'm supposed to? As a freaking pet? Yes. It's it's weird. I'll just go. Keep the jacket. No, if you're going, you're taking the jacket. Claire, I told you, I have like a thousand jackets. Well, what if you need this one one day? What's so special about that one? I don't know, what if it's warmer than the others? Claire, it really doesn't matter, it's fine, just wear it. I don't want to wear it. Why, aren't you cold? Yes, but then wear it. Dog. See you tomorrow in English, Claire. No, you're coming with me. What, with you where? To my house. Until I can get some normal clothes on and give you your jacket back. It's literally just a jacket. Serenity! Okay, okay, I'll come, I'll come. Thank you, let's go. Don't you have to wait on your sister or something? This is more important, let's go. This doesn't make any sense. Now, okay! There you are. I was wondering when you girls were gonna get home. Oh, who's this and where's your sister? I thought Aria would be home by now. No, you two always walk home with each other from school. Well, I guess today we didn't. So who's your friend? Really nice seeing Claire make some friends. Mom, I have Nikki and Chase's friends. Yes, yes, and of course they're great, but it's nice seeing some new friends. So don't be rude and introduce me to your friend. Right. This is my friend. Serenity. Well, it is nice meeting you, Serenity. She doesn't talk much, does she? Oh, seriously? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. But look, you are on the shift tonight to work. I thought Aria was working tonight. No, both of you are. Your shift starts in 15 minutes. Okay, well, give me and Serenity 15 minutes and I'll start working. Of course, honey. It is so nice meeting you, Serenity. Yeah. Come on, we can go to my room. Claire? Oh, shit. You were supposed to walk home with me from school. What the tail? You just left me there? Aria, do not make a scene in the store. I'm sorry, Mom, but she just left me at the school. You were capable to walk home on your own. But I understand how upset you are. So Claire, why didn't you walk home with your sister? What the tail is she doing here? She's my friend. Aria. Yes, this is her friend Serenity. She's a little quiet, but she seems very friendly. Friendly, please. She threw a pie in your face today at lunch. What? Claire, is this true? Yes, but mom, it's a long story and I, she apologized and I forgave her. Why did she throw a pie in your face? Is that her jacket? Mm, it's my fault. Damn right it is. Aria language. Someone told me to throw a pie in her face and I felt really, really peer pressure and I'm really, really sorry for throwing a pie in your daughter's face. <sighs> I do understand peer pressure. But please do not do it again to my daughter. Ma'am, I'm really, 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 really sorry. So what, everybody's just gonna forgive and forget about what she did? Arya, I think that's enough. You need to start your shift. I thought Claire was working tonight. Both of you are because I need the extra help. Ugh. You go ahead and get started and Claire, finish whatever you have to do with your friend and then start your shift. Yes, mom. Come on, Serenity, let's go. <laughs> Can you grab my bag on the way up to my room? Our room. So this is my room and your sister's. Yeah, yeah, it's my sister's too. My bed's a pink bunk and hers is the blue up there. Cool. Yeah, so let me change out of this real quick. Where do you want me to put this thing? Uh, for now just set it beside my bed. While I pick out a necklace to wear. It's kind of hard to choose. No, because they're all pretty colors. But you know, I guess it's a nice problem to have. Why do you want to take my jacket off? We've gone over this, Serenity. It's your jacket. It's not mine. But I was being nice. And I really do appreciate it, Serenity, but I'd rather pick something of mine out. Hmm. 
but which color should I do? Pink, blue, white. I mean, if you really think about it, pink matches those polka dots in your ears, and then the blue complements your eyes, and then the white just shines out. I also see you have a black in there. That would look pretty cool. What? What? You asked for my opinion. Yeah, I mean, I know I did. It was just a weird response. I'm sorry. Why do you apologize so much? It's okay. I guess I'll just go with the pink for now. Seems like a safe color. You know what, Serenity? Serenity? Your bed is like really comfortable. Get out of it. But I'm tired. But it's weird. Okay, you know what? Why do you keep saying everything I do is weird? Why do you keep saying I'm weird? I don't know. It's just some of the things you do are just... Well, I mean, weird. But explain to me how they're weird. You know, just... Just... Why do you have a liking to me? What do you mean? I mean, like, you're just so nice to me. And you're more outgoing to me than to everybody else. You'll barely speak a word to anybody. But to me, you speak a thousand words. When at first, you know, you weren't that open to me. I don't know, like, I just, I feel more open to you than everybody else. Serenity. You can just call me Seren. Isn't that what Kinsley and Tara call you? Yeah, but it's shorter than Serenity, so I can't really think of another name. Like a nickname, you know? What about Eternity? That's a weird nickname. It's not that weird. I mean, it kind of sounds like Serenity, and if you move some letters around and maybe add one or two letters, it sounds similar to Serenity. That would be Erenity. Okay, well that sounds even weirder, so I'm calling you Eternity whether you like it or not. I like it. Yeah, but it's just a nickname between us two. Okay. Weren't you gonna change out of that and give it back to me? I think I'll keep it on for now. Oh, well, what made you change your mind? I don't know exactly. Well, that's okay. We'll figure it out. <laughs> yeah, sure. Don't worry, I'm not here to ruin anything. I just wanted to come say I'm sorry. If Claire forgives you, I should forgive you. No words? She's just got a warm up to you is all. She's shy, but she's bold enough to throw a pie in your face. Well, she said Kinsley told her to do that. Of course she did. But I'm really am sorry I ganged up on you like that. It's okay. <laughs> she did it. Yeah, she's she's been doing it. <laughs> to me at least. She'll come around. Yeah, I know. But the other reason why I came up here is because mom wants us to start, you know, our shift. But again, sorry to interrupt anything, but Saran's gotta go home. Right. Yeah, so you might want to give the jacket back. Okay, so do you want it back? Or... No, it's okay. You can keep it. Okay. I will see you tomorrow. Um, yeah. One second, though. Your phone? Yeah, uh, put your phone number in it. Oh, okay. Here you go. Thanks. Uh, I'll see you tomorrow? Yeah. See you tomorrow.